My name is Jennifer Foster and I am a member of Christ Community Church and also a board member and I volunteer in KidZone. Well, I originally started coming to Christ Community because my parents, Randy and Jane Kohick, started coming. And with our kids, we just found that this church really focuses a lot on that generation, kids just growing, kids in Christ, and so that was really a draw for us. But since I had taken my kids to Kids Zone so often, as they got older, I just felt the need to give back and to serve in that way. So that's how I got involved with Kids Zone. My parents had been serving on the board, and I just thought that was such an important thing, be a part of how this church moves forward. And one thing led to another, and um, now I'm on the board, which is uh, just amazing. So really, as I surrender to God, I find that He gives me peace. I've always been a um, high-strung controller, and the more I seek God and the more I listen and obey whatever it is He tells me to do, whether that's serving in Kids Zone, whether it's serving on the board, um, whether it's outside of church, um, I have found that he just m multiplies whatever expectation I have so far beyond what I can even imagine. And there's no fear in following that at all. I grew up in the church and giving was always something we did. I remember my mom handing us dollars to stick in the collection plate when I was little. And I wasn't born again until I was 19. Um, and then through my 20s, I kind of did my own thing. Um, but then I became a mother and we got more active in the church. And God was just working with me on really my attitude toward money. And I've always just had a very unhealthy attitude toward money and focused far too much on it. I worried, and when I had too much or more than I needed, I spent it on things that I didn't need. And so, it's really been a work in progress for me. So, my husband and I began tithing, um, maybe four or five years ago, and God, the reason I, we did it initially was because we were just being obedient. The word says you're to tithe. And so initially it started out as an obedience thing. This is what I'm supposed to do. But I have found that God has transformed my finances and got them under control. I mean, um, you know, every year you tend to make a little more money, but I, we just have such an abundance since we began tithing. And it's, it's supernatural, so you can't even like specifically see where you're getting more money. It's just, um, he provides. And he's also taught me that, um, not taught me, but revealed that it's not, a, it's not an obedience thing. God doesn't need my money at all. He wants my heart, and my heart for a long time focused too much on money. And he also wants my trust. He wants me to give it so that um, I can see that he's faithful and that I can count on him and I don't need to do it myself. And so I just want to glorify him with all that I have, whether that's serving, um, whether it's tithing, whatever he calls me to do. I just want to be faithful to him because he gave all that I have to me. There's so much exciting stuff happening here, um, and it's grown so much even since I've since I've gone here. Pastor Mitch and Pastor Dina and all the pastoral staff, they just have this incredible vision of making this place a safe zone for the community. And their vision for growing with the, the building, C3 Sports, and with Abba's House, they're really trying to reach every person in this valley. And it's really exciting to see because I, I don't even think any of us has any idea what a change and what a purpose 
Christ community has in State College. I mean, the ability we have to reach people all over the world through the live streaming, all of the sporting events that we're going to bring through the new building, the concerts, um, the conventions, we're going to have people from all over the world coming through here. and. God is giving us an, an opportunity to be obedient to that by funding these um, projects, by, by sacrificing to fund these projects so that we can reach the world. I mean, that is our goal, is to reach every person for Christ. I just love this church, and I'm honored to be able to help in any way that I can.